there's actually two different types of electrodes. There's your copper-based electrodes, which are the common ones that we use all the time in resistance welding. And then the elkanite. The elkanite is actually a trade name. It's the refractory electrode is what they call it. And it's when we take a, uh, a covering, you may say, or a certain thickness of that refractory material and braise it to the top of a copper electrode. And they're used primarily for crosswire welding or projection welding, anything that is going to indent into a typical copper electrode. Copper is basically softer material and so it does have a tendency to show up those imprints from those components that you're welding and so we use the refractory material which is a harder based tungsten based type material to withstand those forces of the projections or the crosswire from leaving those imprints into the material itself.